Hello everyone and welcome back to Koromon. I'm Monster Matt here and thank you so much for checking out the video today. We're uh, still climbing the power tower and we've reached uh, the fifth floor which is getting increasingly convoluted by the looks of it. Um, hopefully you guys are having a good week though and hopefully your Friday is going well and you're going to have yourself a nice weekend. Uh, Embaval is down, that's right. So we're kind of still fighting our way up, the, up, up the, this tower and honestly like I don't know which side to start on. I guess this door is open, so we'll start here. Uh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't even see that door over there. Uh, I need to get through that switch there, person. Time for a change of pace from these security measures. What? Aren't you yourself a security measure? I don't really see how you're not. Oh good, he has one too. Well, that's potentially problematic. Uh, I don't really have any great responses to that on me, do I? I have Fiddly, though. There's also a few things that I've been learning, because we've been streaming this game as well on Thursday nights. Um, I, I was separate a save file for that, and some things I've been learning have really been interesting. Like, uh, we missed two Cormon entirely back in uh, Woodlow Forest. Uh, Bitty Bolt and uh, Frova, which is a, an electric type cat who was frip, 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 I can't even speak, flip, flap, and adorable, and um, a little, little ice bug bug. So I've got them on my team in that playthrough, seeing what, what all we can do. We're also playing that one on hard, though. So it's a kind of a whole different kettle of fish. Yeah, Fiddly with a three hit, nice. Ooh, we're skating kind of close to the, close to the bottom of the barrel there on that one, though. More attack would probably be a good idea. Okay, we gotta fix this defense of ours too, really. Just put some kind of help there. Level 18. Last stand. The rest of the round is your endures when HP falls below below one. Oh, cool, so it's it's endure literally. That's fine. Uh nah, yeah, it's fine. Level 20 for Lance a lot. Very nice indeed. Ooh, that helps get kinda squeaky. Arawara. Does this dude have all three starters? He does, doesn't he? And my fire type is in the shop. Uh, that's a problem. Uh, ha, 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 ha. I know this thing has water moves anyway. Voltaia should be okay, because electric and ice are neutral to each other and resists water. So. Beat up. Please don't beat me up. I don't want to be beat up. I don't know who would want to get beat up, I guess, but you know what I mean. Uh, we're gonna go for an inner piece. Cross jump. Oh no. Yeah. We're gonna need Voltaire to pull us through this, I think. The nice thing is that this um this tower appears to have like um checkpoints every floor. So we can get out of here and heal if we need to, I think, without too much trouble. There's that splash. That one does damage equal to your level, apparently. But we resisted, so I guess that makes sense. It did, it did 20 damage and then got cut in half. Okay. That makes sense. Uh, blast away, blast away, blast away all, please. There we go. It'll be forced to take a rest this turn as well. So why don't we go for another inner piece, because we can use Quad Bolt next turn. Quad Bolt always goes first, and with the, the, the increased stats... Hopefully, it will be hitting about as hard as Lightning Strike does. Or harder, even if we're lucky. There we go. Alright, Voltea. If I'm right, the Nibblegar is up next. Or, I guess, the Evolved Form, which is Sheer Tooth, I believe. We have one of those in our in our other playthrough. And that would pretty much save our bacon, because Voltea could take, that thing, could take Sheer Tooth down basically instantly. Yep. All right, well, no offense there, Mr. Pudgy Shark friend, but, uh, bye-bye. You are water, and I am lightning, and, I have a, and I've had buffs, so just, yeah. It's a bad time to be you. <laughs> a thousand experience, my goodness. Well, Taya, you are a monster, and I absolutely love you. Because you are saving my bacon so hard. Worth noting, though, uh, Bitty Bolt, on top of being adorable and also an electric type, has a neat ability... I forget what it's called, or trait rather. Uh, I forget what it's called, but basically it makes it do like 20% more damage, but it costs more SP to do things. 
So even though their uh, um, stats aren't quite as ridiculous as Voltea's here, as far as attack goes, they're doing alright for themselves, I gotta say. I don't want to bu buffer speed a bit, but like at the same time, I don't think it's gonna matter too much. Maybe just more tanky is the way to go. Well, at least some power, you know? It's 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 what she does. What do you do? Alright, good job everyone. Can you imagine if you'd be working at the top floor? Is this not the top floor? My goodness, how tall is this thing? Did that Okay, no, I, I, I thought I had changed like, like the, the laptop screen with the switch, but no, it just happened to change colors at that exact moment. Uh, so a oh wait, no, there was an A, actually hang on, there was an A there too, wasn't there? Was there a loot that I didn't get? Yes, I must loot first. I should probably heal first, considering, but... Honestly, at this point, I think it's time to stop being so picky about who gets what and where goes why, because, like, yeah. Our team is in bad shape. I just need to start, like, getting through it. Delphor! I helped design the security measures on this floor. Do you think they're effective? I mean, I think that Sylph Co. wants to hire you. <laughs> considering that you yeah. seem to share their love in whirly-twirly floor business. Do your thing, and don't hit with that, please, because that will sting mightily. Yeah. Yeah. He's so angry. I, I I'm a little bit jealous though, because like I'm trying to use different uh, Koruma between this file and the other file, and we found uh, potent Ar Ar Armadu. So I'm I, I mean, I'm kind of ah ha ha kind of jealous of my other file a little bit, because I'm not going to use them, because we have our 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 uh, our John on this file, you know. I wasn't going to double them up. I guess I could if I wanted to, but... You know what? Because I have a need of health, but also a little of SP here. Didn't really need the SP as much, but I didn't want to use my last medium health cake either, so... It'll, it'll, it'll do. Propeller punch! And the lead takes him out. Alrighty. 17 for grit. His stats continue. Ooh, Digmo. Digmo's got a really cool design, actually. He's like a like a like a weasel ferret like dirt dragon. It's kind of a kind of a neat idea. So that'll trap me and keep me from leaving, which is all well and good, because I'm not going anywhere. I'm pulling off your face. There's that lovely, lovely attack stat we love so much. Deep cut really is a fantastic move for just digging in and fighting. Makes them bleed, makes you stronger. Does good damage. What's not to love? Only one for John. Oh, I should work on improving my battle skills instead. Not your fault, dude. The power of the power of John is unlimited. Skill flash seven. What have we here? EMP. None of them you can. All right, well, fine then. Jeez. <laughs> at, least, at, least, at least it tells you up front, like, yeah, no. Just, mm -mm. Try again later. I'm like, oh, okay. Sorry. Whee! All right. We have the D and the F and a box containing Phoenix Stones. I guess we'll just pull both of these. I don't really know what else we'd be doing with them. Um, no, we need to... Hmm. Hmm. Okay, we need to... Do that first. And then we need to pull this. Now we need to do this. We can get back out in here, switch this, go this way, uh, there's an A there, I don't know if that matters to us or not at this moment though, we need to get to the F door, which is right there, oh there's two ways through, that's kind of cool, 
She... Oh dang. There we go. Eleven. Scream. What does scream do? Red and iron with, with ear piercing screech, lowering their defense by two stages. Ooh, not bad. Maybe. Not overly concerned about that at this, this moment. I'm gonna leave. Well, I, I, I do want to level up Lancelot as well, in fairness. Turn, please. Thank you. Eh, I guess I'll fight you while I'm here. I should. Where do all these treadmills even lead to? Nowhere, that's the point. They go around and around and around and around and around. Run, get around, get around, get around. Dry wind. Alright, sandy sandiness. Let's pop a howl. Or not. Usually they just kind of defend themselves, but I guess he's going for the offense this time. Not bad. If I'm lucky. Nope. Got a crit. I, I I I thought I'd survive that, but I was wrong. If he hadn't got the crit, then then then, then we would have, I think. But. Damn. Damn. Well, I mean, at least we have our, 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 our Dill here to put them in a pickle. But, um, we should be able to muscle through this pretty well. The probably punch his knockdown could flinch us, though, which is kind of a thing I don't want to have happen. And it didn't! So, hey. There's that attack up we like. We're gonna come out of this tower with, like, the most, you know, just ridiculously strong, um... Do ever. I really want Grant's stats to start like doing things though. His like his stats are not going up, like at all, and it's kind of alarming me a little bit. I don't, I don't, I don't even know where to put his offense. I guess there. But... Just keep clawing. Norm might be worried about that, but like it's 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 because it's a, it's a, a special attack. And our defenses in that area aren't fantastic, but his attack in that area sucks too, so. It's kind of like, eh, whatever. <laughs> that could be a problem, though. Please don't have three hits. Thank you. Damn. Double slash. Uh, slash is there. In, in, normal, in normal circumstances, this deck will always hit. Oh, it's a pretty solid hit too. Seventy-five. That's higher than deep cut. What, what do you call it? Four? So it costs less, but does more damage. I guess because it, it doesn't have the bleed and the and, and the power up. That's nice. All right, we'll drop scratch for that. That's some that's some that's some mean mean power right there. Makes me a little nervous about fighting other armadillos. All right, this guy is the evolved form of, of uh, Buzz that we know that much, and we have just enough juice to double slash it, which should be super effective, yes? Yeah. So fingers crossed, he's first. Yeah, there we go. That is some nice power. Because Bazaar is not exactly flimsy. He's fairly solid, so... That is a mean hit. Granted, we, got, we, 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 we have our, our, our attack boosted, but still... I'm a new intern, so I have no idea how to get around yet. That would be a problem. Yeah, I mean, these environments really would be kind of a kind of a doozy for like interns, wouldn't they? Like, hey, welcome to your first work day here at Lux Solus in in the Power Tower. I sure hope you know how 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 to like remember you know complex paths in your head because if you don't, you know, because like they don't have like like the God's Eye top down view that we have. We can see where the where the conveyor belts go pretty easily, but they have to just kind of like be like uh, mm, eh, mm, and just kind of roll with it, you know. Not easy. Phoenix stones. HP cake mediums. SP cakes. See? 
We should really just go heal. Okay, give me a minute, you guys. I'm gonna go heal. Because honestly, like, as much as I want to keep going, my team is in pretty bad shape. Alrighty, we're back. Okay, sorry about that. The ice is down here. Hey, let's battle for science, I guess. For oh, science. Sciencey science. <laughs> Potent Goldwing versus our Embaval. Okay. I remember if Goldwing was more susceptible to physical or special. Let's try special. Seems to work just fine. Peck. Ours never learned Peck. Odd that Peck is a higher level move than, you know, other things. Like Wind Blast, for example, yeah. There we go, no sweat. I also found a sloth gem outside on the beach. On the there's a there's a couple sand castles out on the beach on the way here. And in my stream I found uh, a sloth gem, which is like a better lazy gem on the rightmost sandcastle, and I picked it up on the way here, because I forgot that I it hadn't... I don't know if I didn't check there, or, or if it was new, because, like, some things have definitely changed since the game first... Uh, since I started recording. Like, um, like that thing where, where like, Armadou had, um, Concentrate added, and, like, uh, Tactical Slam was moved to a later level. You know what I mean? Like, I think, I think there, there have been some updates that have moved some things around, so... It just might not have been there before. Who knows? Ooh, he's potent as well. Aren't you special? Like I said, you're pretty defensive. Let me drop your defense a bit and try to and try our, our, our fire slam. That worked pretty well. Oh, it was a crit. Well, fair enough then, I guess. Done and done. Like I'll say that like Fiddly and Grit get the same XP because they have slow, they have sloth gems or uh, lazy gems. Then you'll notice that uh, Lancelot gets like way more because the sloth gem. Oh, hello. Good timing. Lunar Ghost Doggo becomes ooh bigger Lunar Ghost Doggo by the looks of it. Nice. Lancelot evolved into Lunar Wolf. Lunar Pop, Lunar Wolf. Makes sense. That's pretty cool, though. Still would, nice, would be nice if it, learned, if it would learn a special attack, though. Make use of that stat it's got. Hello, darling. Look at you. You're big and you're scary. Menacing is still a little thing. Yep. Alright, well. Stat-wise, uh, still kind of awesome. Looking forward to using that. Eye opens over there. Okay. We need to move anything else? The G, for example? I don't think we have a G yet, do we? No, G is this one. Which lets me into E. Which is down there. We might... Eh, well, maybe then. Let's go ahead and assume we'll need to... Uh, assume we'll need to do that. E. And the G... I don't know if that's what we actually need to do or not. Oh, hey, we, yes. This way. I, G, F. Dang it, where's the F? Where is the F? Uh, door, oh, duh. Where is it, where is the F? Oh, it's down there, in the A, uh, okay. We're uh, F'd in, wah. I get the joke. The F is in the A. Ha 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 ha. Very funny. <laughs> uh, I don't think we can actually get to here from there. We need to we need to open the D again first, don't we? Crud. Uh, ha, ha, hmm. How are we gonna do that? I. 
okay, eh? No, it's the D I needed. That's right, sorry. Uh, okay. And then the D switch was... In here. No, that's E. Where is the D switch? Oh, it's in the other room, isn't it? It's over there. So I need to open the A. So I do need the A. My goodness. Back and forth and around and around. Round and around and around and around. Come on, baby. Let's do the twist. Um, a is up here as well. Wait, did I even need that one? It's just the F I needed, right? I think. F is right there, yeah, so... I think I, I didn't pull the F, did I? That F is now open, so now I and G need to open. Okay, okay, we got this. We got this, I think. <laughs> don't don't quote me on that just yet, but I think. E gets us into there. E uh, no, I think I need to pull the F still. But F is open. Oh, dang it. Okay. Hold that thought, then. Because to get to I... Where's the I again? It's there in the E. Okay, that's that's fine. What about G? Where was G again? G is right there, through the F. Okay. G... Now we need to go shut off the F on this side. No! Puzzle Mania! <laughs> there, okay, that should do it. Thank Christmas. Why there yet? Oh. What are you doing here? At least show me some identification. Uh, sure, here you go. Oh, you're Coromat. Apologies. You, you, you look nothing like like Ruggle described. How did he describe me? You're here to collect some of Volker's essence, right? Well, you're almost there. Just one more elevator. Let me remind you about our checkpoint system. Observe! Checkpoint reached. <laughs> Convenient, huh? To think they're sending someone to collect essence again. I sure hope you have enough Coromat cakes. Uh... That's not ominous or anything. Like, ah I sure hope you're ready to get your butt kicked. What? <laughs> oh, was, oh, wow, okay, yeah. A mention, a mention of needing enough health items and a luxury call right before the door. This is gonna hurt, isn't it? Let's do it. Honey, I'm home! Well, not really, but... <laughs> Hello? Oh, here it comes. Oh, wow, okay, hi! It speaks! Big Daddy speaks! What is this? Another who seeks my essence? Did the last bit not suffice? Uh, I came here to ensure your safety. There are... I dare say... Oh, he's, 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 he's posh. I dare say. It is the other way around. It's bad enough being bound to this physical, inferior form. Must you now pester and prod at me with your whim? I... You. You shall know the power of the Bender of Storms. Uh-oh. He mad. He angry. <laughs> Got some big hands and feet, man. The storm's raging through Venowa. Did you think they happened by chance? They are my doing! <coughs> 25. Owie. But he knows Destructo Disc. That's cool. And he can multi-hit. That's less cool. 
No idea if it's a physical attack or a special one, but I'm hoping that our uh, defense will help. Let's see. Nope, not a little bit, not even a little bit. Yay, it's a special attack. I have no defenses against that. <laughs> I'm gonna die. So how does this work? Anyway, do I just fight him and then like, can I catch him? Is there a thing I can do? I assume not, but let's worry about living first, huh? Well, actually, you know what? Yeah, let's um, let's heal right away. And we'll see see if, about considering maybe trying to catch the thing in, in a second here. Sick music, though I gotta say. Definitely gets the uh, the boss vibe across. Now is a bad time to be shocked, there, Grit. Dang it, man! Oh no! <laughs> Oh, I just realized he has 400 health as well. Oh my god, I didn't even know. I didn't, didn't even look at that before. Oh no! And over 60 stamina. Okay, yeah. Uh huh. Hmm. <laughs> Let's try a Fury Fist, see if that does anything, anything better for us. Nope, we have no stamina. We're dead anyway. Yay! Stamina dead. Yeah. Alright, John. You have the raw power. You can try to deep cut this guy, and then go for double slash. That might do something for us. Yeah. Well, they definitely did some more damage. And he's bleeding. We didn't get the attack boost I was hoping for, though. Hit him again. Man, that hurts. Nah, don't miss. Not now. Ain't got time for that. Fine, right, just double slash him before you die, then. I, I suspect Surge Punch is physical, because it definitely seems to do... Like it has a higher, uh, I, I think it has a higher damage, but it like, doesn't, you know what I mean? It doesn't, um, like it has higher base damage, but probably, uh, because we have higher defense, it balances it out. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Come on, John. Oh, that's gonna hurt so bad, like, uh, hell. Well, we're getting some damage off on him, at least. Stop missing, please! We really don't have time for that. Back up? No? Okay, well, fine. Had the try. Yeah. If anyone can do this, it's, just, it's, it's probably John. We've been doing a lot, we've been doing a lot, a lot better for ourselves. Oh, oh. Huh! Did you think it was almost over? No. But. Oh no. My storms will cleanse me from your puny status infections. Oh, good. 
So he's, what is he, is he bleed proof now? Static particles. Behold the power of the bender of storms. These static particles will make it more difficult for your Coromon to move. Ha ha! Crap. Static haze. All skills cost more SP. Man, that's just rude. <coughs> of course, I mean, it, it doesn't specify that it doesn't work on him either. But he's got a lot more SP than I do. No, John, I would really, 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 really like it if you get some attack. I never remember dead. Crap. <laughs> um. Lancelot. We'll have to wait. I want to try and burn him first. Also, what I should have done was start off with him before and, and, and land some uh, defense downs on him to try and. Never mind. To try and make him more susceptible to John. Doesn't seem, doesn't seem like that's gonna matter, though. I just realized this guy is going to. Oh my god, that's such a swole dog. Holy crap. This thing is going to, like, crap my team out dead when I get to this thing in, um. in hard mode. Oh my god. It's a hypno way, but it'll it, it, it give him his stamina back. I don't want him to do that. Oh, he's out of gas. Ooh, um, hmm. Go for it then, I guess. Come on. No. You had one job. I did nothing. Oh my god. Remember when I was like, hey, you know, I, I, I want to overgrind for these things. Apparently, I was a fool. A foolish fool who fools foolishly. On the other hand, I kind of dig that, like, it's so powerful. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it's kind of, kind of a, kind of a, a, a damage hike, and yeah, it kind of sucks in some ways. But on the other hand, like, it's just kind of cool to find a boss that that, 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 like, rocks this hard, you know? Revive the John. That is the one thing that Voltaire here is most of for right this moment, honestly. It's just getting our team back into, you know, relative, relatively one piece. I'm gonna try the, uh, the Ember Ball John thing again. I don't wanna blow through all my Phoenix Stones, but at this exact moment, I, I, I kind of need them. Either of you guys need any SP? Yeah, you kind of do, don't you? Well, you're fine. I, no, no. It, it's, 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 it's enough to use his move. That's what really matters. What, you're getting low on gas again? Okay. Um, I kind of don't want him to... I, 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 I'd like to... Uh, you know, well... He might rest on this turn, actually. I don't know, I'm a little torn on that one. Yeah, he did, okay. Well, let's try and let's try and hold up until his next rest then. I don't know how likely that is, but maybe. Why are we going first? What's he doing? 
Ah, that's why. He's gearing up for the big punch. Well, we resist most of what he does, so that's good at least. Running out of gas, though. Might as well throw a combi cake in there. Maybe Surge Punch is a special move, because like we're taking we're taking less damage from it now. And we're juiced up enough, we're actually 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 starting to do damage to him. Does Voltea have the power we need to overthrow the Titan? I mean, you never know. She is pretty darn strong. Wait, can you double electrify? Is that thing, is, is that thing, uh, uh, a thing you, you, can, you can even do? Uh-oh. This new vessel struggles to contain all of my power. Uh oh He's shocking everyone, isn't he? No, just two of them. Oh, wait, no, they're the, they're, they're, they're the only two that are alive. No, they're not. No, they aren't. <laughs> Never mind. So he's just zapping things at random now, applying shock wherever he likes, because he can just do that, apparently. Because he's rude. Well, he's angry, but he's rude, I guess, but still. Oh, good. Super punch. No, he needs to recharge. And I'm out of, I'm out of juice. Ah, I'm, out of, I'm, 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 I'm out of everything. No. Well, fine, heal. I should have combi caked, I'm a fool. No, I made mistakes. But dude's got a hyper beam, that's good to know. Also terrifying. The worst part of that of that, of that uh, disc attack he does, honestly, is is the, how much SP it depletes out of you with three hits. That's pretty heavy, pretty heavy damage. Not good. All right, blast away. Aha! We denied him his super punch. That's pretty cool, actually. Take that, dude. Comic cake medium. I love how all of my strategy just, just went the window when I realized that Voltaic is, is, is also kind of a god herself. Like, yeah, you know, Ebbaval and John and yada yada, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Voltaic's got this. Throughout the course of this fight, she's grown to her maximum power. Not even you can stand against her now, Volkar. Shaboom. Super punch! Yeah, it hurts. I'll give you that. Doesn't hurt enough, though. Blast him. All right, I don't think we can catch this thing, but I'm gonna try. Yeah, I figured. Poop, poop on you. Maybe later. <laughs> yeah, woo! This, uh, Volgar still terrifies me though. And honestly, like I'm seriously concerned about my team in our, on our hard run now. 
Because on hard, if if, if a Coromon faints, you lose them. And my team is full of full of potents that I worked kind of hard on getting. So I'm gonna need to get my my uh, my ground type up to snuff and just like shut this guy out immediately, or else use my my um, my uh, Bitty Bolt to, to to just you know go electric versus electric just like uh, uh, Voltaire here did. Because like then again, ooh, Bitty Bolt has an SP increasing thing, so I don't know if he's got the stamina for that. That's gonna hurt. Oh boy. Well, we'll figure it out when we get there. Next, next, next Thursday, I think. Boulder Barrage. Hey, that's a that's a that's a that's sand move, isn't it? Yeah. Ooh. I mean, that's probably better for him than this. I don't really use Cinder. I can, I can, like like oh no no I do. Sorry, it's like, um ignite them not. I don't really tend to use Slam anymore. So. Boulders. For John. Yeah, you can have some more, some more of this for the next time this happens. Lancelot, everyone's getting potential. Everyone's just like, I awaken. Yeah, fighting what basically amounts to a god will do that to you, I guess, huh? Hmm. You still have a ways to grow, but I sense great potential. Go then, take my essence. Make it count this time. Yay! Received electric essence. Now my siblings await you. As for me, I need to recharge. The storm beckons me back. Thank you, sir, for not totally killing me, even though you tried. I can almost see my house from here. <laughs> I love that they throw that in there. Just, you know, you almost died. Your team's in shambles. The Thunder God has retreated to his lightning fortress or whatever in the sky. And he's just like, I can see my house from here! Like, shut up! <laughs> uh -huh. I wonder if he's in here. I'd definitely make a, make a, make a, make a note in my diary if I, could, if, if, if I fought Thor. No, doesn't look like it. Where do you get you from, anyway? Shimshell, you're over in Vermeer Grotto. And then you, Pawberry. Huh. All right, let me get the heck out of here. Pretty proud of myself for getting it done in, in, in the first trial that we had to blow out items to do it. Yellow. Hey, Rago, what's up? Hello. Hello, Koromat. Just heard what happened to Thomas. Is everything okay at the power tower? Did the kidnappers reach Voltgar? There's no trace of them. They must have went somewhere else. Oh, I see. Well, that's fortunate. Then could you meet me and meet me and Nicola at at, at the Buzzlet Lab? We need to discuss our next move. Of course, I'll be there soon. All right, see you there, Shane Bright. Shane Bright. Phew. We made sure checkpoints are abundant in, in, in difficult situations, so that battle racers can visit Trainer Hub before they continue. That is nice of you. Ugh. I'm in such pain. <laughs> Floor five, four, three, two, one. How about the exit? Nah. One is okay. It's pretty much a straight shot to the door from here anyway, so... Oh boy, what a fight though. Well, I think what I'm gonna do then, you guys, is go heal, put our team back together, and then we'll go see what, what Rigel and company are up to and wanting from us on the next one. Well, thank you so much for being here, everybody. Hopefully you enjoyed our epic clash with Voltgar, and he was definitely epic. But I hope you guys have a great Friday, a wonderful weekend, and I will see you all back on Monday for some more Coromon. Of course, you're welcome to join our streams. We stream Monday to Friday at 6.30 p.m. and every other Saturday as well. So if you want to hang out with us, we'd love to have you. But even if, even if I don't see you, I hope you have a great day. Take care of yourselves because you're worth it. Shine bright, stay monstrous, and for now, a Monster Mad out. Bye-bye!